week scan to check whether my placenta has budged out of the way. I can't believe we're going to this scan. I remember booking it at our 20 week, um, at our 20 week anatomy scan. I remember thinking, oh gosh, 34 weeks, the baby will be really close and it seems like ages away and now we're going to the scan. If you're not up to date with pregnancy stuff, then um, basically at our 20 week scan, they told us that my placenta was slightly low didn't look like it was gonna cause any problems, but obviously they need to check that it has budged out of the way. <laughs> we just had the hardest time trying to find a car parking space. We're finally here and I'm hoping we have enough time to grab a coffee because whenever we turn up here, we end up having to wait like half an hour for our appointment. I wanna grab a coffee beforehand. I've left Doug to wait for our coffees because I need to check in and then he'll meet me in the waiting lounge. There he is. Thanks. We're back and the good news guys, not only has my placenta moved, so it went from being, wow I look huge, <laughs> it went from being like down here in the way of the exit to, um, it's still at the front, I've always had an anterior placenta which means it's at the front. It's moved up kind of over here. So it's out of the way, um, and not only that, um, I don't know if I told you guys that she's breech, well she was breech, and I think in the last couple of days she's moved around because I even thought in my head last night that her movements feel a little bit different. Turns out she has flipped round, so she's no longer breech, her head is down. By my cervix, I'm ready to go in under six weeks now. Everything's looking good to go, all of her measurements are bang on in the centre of all the charts, and the ultrasound technician sounded very happy with all her measurements. Oh, and we also got an estimated weight for her at the moment. So her estimated current weight is five pounds, three ounces. Which is funny because my midwife, every time I see her, and the last two times I've seen my midwife, she said that she's measuring quite small, but that's only with a tape across my belly. Last time I saw my midwife, I was 20... Uh, no, I was 31 weeks and I was only measuring at 28, 28 centimetres, but they like you to measure pretty much the same centimetres as week, if that makes sense. Anyway, I'm going off subject here. So yeah, maybe that's changed, but if not, maybe baby is just really short but chubby. <laughs> Who knows? But yeah, I'm really happy with that. I'm going to um, wrap up some parcels that I have down here for my Depop that I need to get sent off. Oh, I've got an ASOS parcel as well that I need to wrap up. And then we're gonna head into town. I need to go to the post office. home and it's decided to chuck it down. We've taken shelter and I'm kind of hoping it's going to stop but I don't think it's going to. Also I'm on a mission to find chewits on the way home. I've, I've been thinking about chewits for the last couple of days. I just want chewits. I don't know why I just want chewits. <laughs> so I'm hoping I can find some fruit salad chewits but I'm also hoping this rain stops. I couldn't find any chewits anywhere so now just going home and I'm waddling so badly. <laughs> Got some serious waddling going on. I hurt so bad. Gonna make some dinner, uh, not dinner, some lunch. And I see some tuna pasta. So that is what I'm gonna make. And before I get on with editing today's balloon and whilst I wait for my lunch to cook, I'm gonna catch up on this morning's, this morning. Spent way longer than planned watching vlogs on YouTube together. And now I need to get on and edit today's balloon because in a couple of hours, we are going to Doug's parents for dinner. Oh, today's weather calls for this bad boy. I've only worn this a few times. Actually, no, I think I wore this quite a lot when I first got it. It's an old Topshop number. 
I love the smell of it. It reminds me of my old Christmas decorations I had growing up. We had these, um, all these wooden Christmas tree decorations and they smell like that. It is pouring it down again. So I'm taking cover in this. I have finished editing today's balloon. That should be going live now. Yeah, it would have gone live. Off to go get some dinner. And I think this will, this should protect me from the rain. <laughs> and gonna get ready for bed this is oh this is very uncomfortable for me no nope, not enjoying this position at all <laughs> i just thought i just oh right hang on <laughs> well this is attractive i just thought i'd sit closer to the lamp <laughs> See if the lighting was better there we go oh i can't wait to get my hair cut in july it's really annoying that i've got to wait until the beginning of july just want like a little bit off i'm gonna get my makeup off and get in my gym jams and go to bed. I've been really tired today, so I'm looking forward to going to bed for once. And I will see you guys tomorrow. We're almost halfway through Bloon, which I mentioned on Twitter earlier. I can't believe we're almost halfway through this month already and I don't, I don't know where the weeks are going. But yeah, I will see you in tomorrow's Bloon. Bye.